Welcome to the presentation of avoir, the verb to have. We're going to talk about pronunciation, conjugation, and use. Let's start off with pronunciation and conjugation all at the same time. Remember when you have a verb and you would like to use it in a sentence, you must conjugate it or change its ending so that it matches the subject that you wish to discuss. So let's start off with pronunciation as well as conjugation together. For example, for you, or excuse me, for I have, j'ai, the ai is going to make an a sound. What also notice that there is an i in here. Do you recall the verb je suis? It also has an i in here. So both of them have an i and it is I have. So hopefully that will help you remember to put an i there. Tu as, notice that the s is not pronounced because there's no e following it. Tu as. Most A's make a A sound. Again, J, tu A. Il, elle, or on A. Notice this sounds exactly like tu A. They sound the same, although they are spelled differently. Nous avons. Notice we can't pronounce the final consonant. And then, because there's no E to make the N pop, it is going to not be pronounced, but instead nasalize the O sound. Nous avons. Vous avez, easy, makes an A sound. Vous avez, nizi is not pronounced. Il and elles ont. Notice we do not pronounce the T or the N. Instead, the N makes the O nasalized. All right, so let's talk about when we can use it. Uh, there are lots of idiomatic expressions. That can be confusing because in English, we might use a different verb completely. For example, age. Normally in English, we say, I am so many years old. In French, we have to say, I have so many years. So, j'ai 37 ans. Temperature. We must, and I mean must, use the verb avoir when we're denoting that I am hot or I am cold or it is hot outside, then we're going to use the verb faire. Again, if we do not, we are saying something that's probably inappropriate to be using in class. So please remember to use the verb avoir for I am cold, j'ai froid, or the verb avoir for I am hot, j'ai chaud. Also, we can use the verb avoir to say that we are sleepy. Ils ont sommeil. The verb avoir with sommeil means to be sleepy or to be tired or need rest. A fun one to remember is that you have to say you have right or you have wrong. J'avais raison. I was right. Tu as tort. You are wrong. Même quand j'ai tort. J'ai quand même raison. Even when I'm wrong, I am still right. T'as toujours raison. You're always right. Et tu gères le dernier mot. And always the last word. Fun stuff. Fin, a soif, hunger and thirst. Again, you don't say I am hungry or I am thirsty. You have to say I have. J'ai soif. J'ai pleuré toute la nuit alors que j'avais même pas faim. I cried all night even though I wasn't even hungry. J'ai si faim que je pourrais manger. Un... Eh ben voilà. I am so hungry that I could eat. Uh, voilà. Need and want. Is a, are things that we will also have to use the verb avoir. Using j'ai besoin de something. I have need of something. J'ai besoin de quel un. Notice when we use besoin and envie, besoin is need, envie is want. So a big difference. So again, we would say j'ai besoin de, I have need of, j'ai envie de, I would like or I want. To say fear, you have to say j'ai peur de, so j'ai peur de la mort. Same thing for shame, you would have to say uh, j'ai, or the verb avoir, honte. And you can even say um, shame of something. J'ai honte de voir été, je sais pas. I, I'm ashamed of having done something. Ça marche. You can also use avoir 
for the expression of being lucky. You can't say je suis chanceuse. It's not as easy to remember as j'ai de la chance. I am lucky. Uh, de trouver une bicyclette invisible. Uh, finding an invisible bike. C'est amusant, eh? A fun expression is also avoir l'air. And an adjective can mean to seem or seems. Avoir l'air de, that one little preposition, plus a person, then means that you look like. So, il a l'air content. He seems happy. Ce chat, this cat. Qui a l'air de moi? Who looks like me? So, let's review really quick. Uh, we've learned to conjugate, pronounce, as well as use idiomatic expressions with the verb avoir. Let's repeat the pronunciation just for review. J'ai, tu as, il a, nous avons, vous avez, ils ont. And the expressions you can use are J'ai 37 ans, j'ai froid, or j'ai chaud, j'ai sommeil, j'ai raison, tu as tort, j'ai faim et soif, j'ai envie de tout, et besoin de rien, j'ai peur des monstres, j'ai honte des mauvais notes. J'ai de la chance d'un navire. J'ai l'air de mon père. Well, I hope that was helpful for you. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Uh, bon weekend.